What's good y'all, it's your boy Ross back at it again with another video. I know it's been a couple days since I've uploaded anything, but I'm back at it again for you guys. Uh, we're going to check out a Drew McIntyre Claymore kick compilation from 2020. Now, I know you guys were hitting me up about the uh, kind of unfortunate news. Uh, Drew McIntyre ended up catching uh, COVID-19, so I wish him a speedy and uh safe recovery man i, I know that that kind of sucks being the wwe champion you end up catching covid kind of switches up the plans that wwe had uh, had for him and you know they got to kind of work around that but oh the most important thing is making sure that he gets back to full health and you know what i'm saying he's just you know has a, a speedy and healthy recovery man that's the most important thing you know these guys out here they they put their lives and bodies on the line all the time for it so i know it sucks to not be able to do what you love because of covid so just uh you know wishing them a speedy recovery like i'm gonna keep saying because you know it's covid's very serious man i hope you guys are taking it seriously as well as uh it, it has definitely hit us hard last year and, and hopefully soon sooner rather than later man it, it'll it'll die down you know what I'm saying all we can do is uh pray for that so but we're gonna check this compilation out man drew mcintyre definitely is the guy i just wish there was actually crowds to uh, like really enjoy his title reign i think he's really come into his own and uh i'm still not for this goldberg match oldberg match because i i just don't think drew needs this match to solidify who he is already we already know he's a main eventer we already know he's the top guy he doesn't need to have a match with Oldberg. So let's check out some of his Claymore kicks, man. It's actually a pretty good finishing move. It's a believable finishing move that looks like he's literally kicking someone's head off their shoulders. So let's get into it. No way. Claymore kick. City want to see one more time. Oh, Claymore <laughs> kick. That didn't take the Claymore kick. This was before he was the champ, too. Look at the reception he was getting before he was the champ. The referee's count now. King. Oh! <laughs> I'm sorry, yo. I'm sorry, bro. My man didn't deserve that, bro. My man's over there. He's just he's the timekeeper, man. He's just over there to ring the bell, doing his job. And next thing he know, he gets Claymore kicked into oblivion. We gotta go check that out. <laughs> we gotta watch that. <laughs> Look at this. Yeah, I'm just doing my job. Oh, no. Oh, my. Oh, no. Oh. Oh, my. Oh, my. Jeez. Not even going to lie to you. That Claymore kick was beautiful, bro. When he Claymore kicked Re um, um, Brock Lesnar out of the ring at Royal Rumble, that was one of the loudest pops of that night. Right? Of course. Edge coming out there was a huge pop, but that right there, oh man, bro. And it was so great because that was in Houston, and the Houston crowd showed love for Drew McIntyre because no one wanted Brock to win. No one wanted him there anyway. So it was so, so satisfying for him to eliminate him. That was great. Good night, This was Drew Knight, man. This was Roman before he went rogue. And this is crazy, man. Oh, Just the the, how the over he was getting Claymore. when the crowd was like around. He Drew was getting hella over. Drew McIntyre. Oh, no. Countdown. <laughs> <laughs> it's just a it's a Three, good finishing two, move, bro. I remember that. And then he does the kip up. I remember this. Bro, when I say this was so good, bro, this was when Raw was actually somewhat watchable. Not even gonna lie to you, just this hype to see Drew take down Brock Lesnar was so great. We gotta go back again, check these clips out, cause it was just it's, it's who doesn't love seeing Brock get destroyed, man. Countdown. Who don't love it? Three, two, one. Sit your ass down. Sit your ass down. <laughs> then another one. <laughs> you know 
it's coming. Here's the countdown. Bro, he was Whoa. so over, bro. will be quick, but it won't be painless. I wish it was a crowd, man. Claymore! <laughs> Claymore! It just, it just doesn't hit the same without the crowd, man. WrestleMania against the Beast. What did he tell you, Byron? Why would you ever go back to ring Bro, it's just it's it's a nice finishing move, man. It's a real nice finishing move, bro. It looks effective. Oh my god. Oh wow. This might not be the best idea. It just looks very effective. And then bam! Call with one right kiss. Super oh. kick to McIntyre. I just love seeing him, man. Well, bring it, bitch. Claymore. Claymore. Oh, Claymore. Oh, Claymore. Bring it, bitch. Claymore. Again, to the rebound. Watch it out. Onto the ropes. Look out. For someone that tall to hit a move like that. With just such speed, WWE like champions. it's pretty impressive, bro. Two, one. Claymore to MVP. Apologies to a poor turn of promise. This is what I was talking about. It took several men left. <laughs> Claymore. Claymore by McIntyre. And Lana went down off the incidental contact. Oh, McIntyre to Claymore. Bro, it just Lashley. looks so impactful. To the title kick out at one. Look out. It looks very impactful. Heath Slater's not even in his wrestling gear. Uh, another is WWE oh, champion. Just, just Heath Slater. Starting to count down of his own. Oh, and a oh. This feud here was so, so annoying, bro. Like, I don't, like, yo. No one's taking Dolph, Z Dolph Ziggler serious here. Like, come on now. But he's gonna sell the hell out of that Claymore though. Claymore! Claymore! McIntyre! Ziggler will not go away. Now grab it for a steel challenge! Oh, 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 o
the guy and um hopefully like i said he recovers and uh he's able to get back in the ring and do what he loves bro um to be honest with you once again i'm i'm standing by this he should not be facing oldberg at any point because it doesn't enhance his title reign all it says is i beat somebody in their 50s congratulations you know what i'm saying so we'll see where that plays out but honestly man drew he deserves a crowd to really show their appreciation for his work it covid sucks i'm just be honest with you and i i think if we would have been able to have that match at wrestlemania uh drew versus brock and he beats him in the same fashion he did with a crowd oh my god it would have been a beautiful moment bro that would have been one of those wrestlemania moments i remember like when daniel bryan finally won the title at wrestlemania 30 that's a moment i'll remember forever when when you had uh the uh the iconic tlc match at wrestlemania 17 in astrodome in houston that's something i will remember the both of the iconic matches between Shawn michaels and the undertaker at wrestlemania 25 and 26 i will remember and this would have been one of those things i definitely think the crowd would have remembered and a lot of people would have remembered because drew deserved it bro we were tired of brock we wanted brock gone drew deserves to be the guy and he still deserves to be the top guy especially on raw so comment down below let me know if you guys are still part of the drew mcintyre hype train or you guys kind of wanting somebody else to uh, obtain or to obtain the title other than oldberg of course but comment down below let me know your opinions on that i appreciate all the love and support on the channel road to 40k appreciate y'all kicking it with me and i'll see y'all on the next one peace